holiday season and Santa Claus is coming down. So old Saint, I got a peppermint stick for old Saint Nick. You gotta nick me. He got a old big fat bag on his back. You freak me. What's up, Neil? Listen, I'm on Lowe's. Um, oh, it's called a sport of tree. Everybody's buying trees. You got a tree too? Thank you. They're buying trees. All right, I'm on um, the Lowe's network. Oh. Thank you. I got a big fat bag on his bag. All right, guys. I don't know how the reception is here. Over here, it gets a little shady. I don't know. I got four bars on Lowe's network, but oh, somebody left their calculator. Somebody left it. Oh, it's busted. They busted it, that's why. Yeah, Gail. Got an old fat bag on his sack. All right, so guys, we talked about this yesterday during the Black Friday deals video. 25 bucks, I just don't think so, guys. Um, but, you know, I'm waiting. Oh, thank you, Slayer Mate. I appreciate that. Looks good. Thank you, John HVAC. Um, I don't know, guys. You know, where's the USA made stuff? I mean, and it looks like they're doing good. I, I thought this one would do okay. Now, obviously, $39. Um, now, this is not the gunmetal or anything like that. This is your their basic 40-piece um, set, obviously, for $5 cheaper. You could have got the Cobalt 227 piece if you were lucky, but they, they, they're selling them. You know, again, you know, Craftsman's name is where all the value is. And I think Lowe's had a shot to really bring that name up when they first, you know, I remember doing a video two years ago on how excited everybody was rushing to Lowe's because the new craftsman tools are in the stores and they were whoa where's the usa made stuff oh they'll be coming two years later i still don't see any usa made hand tools supposed to be made in connecticut at their Irwin or um the lennox all right again they're selling pretty pretty decent here for low 69 bucks 83 piece um not bad three eighths quarter inch um all six point so you don't gotta worry about any filler so to speak um here 29 bucks all right we saw and this is an 11 piece i think the the husky wrench set right i don't know what was that like a, a it had a lot more pieces than this and it was five dollars cheaper so again very weird pricing home depot shouldn't kill them but the craftsman name maybe i don't know but anyway and this is metric i think that husky set guys <clears throat> came with metric and sae and it was a lot bigger I, don't, I think it was like a 28 piece wrench set here it's just an 11 piece set and i i would not get this but who knows all right now we're getting into the gunmetal all right 179 down to 119 i mean i don't know it's still pretty expensive for a 121 piece set again for another 30 bucks you can either get the tractor supply 227 piece dewalt set all right or the tough system now if you don't want either one of them um you know there's other options i think also but Maybe we'll focus more on some of these mechanics tool sets. You know, obviously the DeWalt tool sets, you can get, you know, I think 121 piece for like 79 bucks at Home Depot or Amazon. 
but you know they're nice looking I, I i really like the sockets not the sockets well the sockets i guess but they had one of the ratchets out i don't know during the summer they're nice and here's this an 81 piece all right and and it had and as you would notice they haven't sold one of these or one of the well maybe they sold one of these but you're seeing a lot of the cheaper stuff kind of gone here all right again guys you go to home depot all this stuff is almost like half gone um i don't know when they announced this but i know they announced it at least three four days ago so this stuff's been out um here's 105 piece for 79 you know you got you know you got home depot is half the stuff's gone um Here's a little organizer for six bucks. I mean, are you serious? You should get this for free. Well, you got a screwdriver organizer for six bucks. And, I mean, again, why would you want it, want this in the first place? Six bucks. All right, 25-piece uh, craftsman set. Now, if all you older people like me... When you see this style screwdriver, you're like, oh, man, I'm just going to flip it over and see USA made on it. Oh, what do you got here? What is that? Like a tick? They got the Craftsman tick. No, that's like a little, that's just like a little ornament there. They're going to throw you a little piece of plastic. You see? It's like a little dog tag. Um, but unfortunately, it's not going to be from USA. You got some Taiwan, Taiwanese screwdriver set. Now, again, we were at Home Depot. I think they had a Husky screwdriver set for $15.99. And, you know, I'm not putting Husky in the Craftsman. Uh, I, th I think they're very similar now, to be honest with you. I mean, I don't think. Here's a 10-piece. Now, we saw that. That six piece, right, for seven ninety nine, or maybe it was nine ninety nine, um, at, at low at, at Home Depot. This set definitely has a little bit more variety. You got some flex um, nuts there, adapters. I mean, um, three eighths, quarter inch, and half inch. It's Twenty bucks though. Doesn't seem like much of a deal. I can go to Amazon and grab. Oh, here's that little one for one sixty nine. I mean, this is tiny, guys. <laughs> Guys, if you remember last year, and they're still available, but I don't think, I honestly think they're still left over from last Christmas. You guys know what I'm talking about, that little husky that had the um, the pegboard, and that, that was like double the size of this, all right? Now, it might have been 26 inches across, but I can tell you, it was, a, this thing is like 26 by 12 inches. I mean, this is really small, guys. Uh, again, it's part of the 2000 series. They're calling this a workstation. Are you kidding me? Guys, this is so small. I don't know how to... I mean, I can put two things on it. And the whole... I mean, where, where my hat... It's really tiny, guys. You know what? What am I doing? We got the auto lock. We got the auto lock here, guys. If I can get my freaking... Yeah, 13 and a half inches. 13, so 26 by 13 and a half inches. They should be ashamed of themselves. All right, here's the auto lock for 20. I think the DeWalt auto locks are the same price. Um, I don't like this locking mechanism on this one, to be honest with you. Oh, here's that cheap set, though, uh, for 10 bucks. This is what I would get. And again, if you kind of get this for like, a, um, I know a lot of ladies are watching, you know, for the husband, the boyfriend, the lover, they're going to think you spent a good 20 bucks on four tape measures. Do you have the white blade on these? Yes. So that's their thing now. So all the craftsmen are rocking with that white blade. Um, don't even go near this for 169 bucks. You'd be on drugs. Um, it is part of the 
the 2000 series, I think. Man, this thing's, that thing is junk. I apologize if you don't. Oh, yeah, look at this. Guys, I love, I did a little video on the Milwaukee one. And I want to say it's the same price. And I'm not, you know, that has a light on it. That is freaking really awesome. Um, and it can really help you out when you're in a jam. Um, I wouldn't put it on your keychain. These things are very big. You're not going to want it. Uh, I think it comes with like a, you know, like a, a keychain ring. Yeah, this is a nine foot. Is this magnetic? It's a pocket tape measure. The DeWalt one is okay too. Um, but I think it's a little bit more money. But, you know, what is this? This is a Pro 10. So this is like their cheap tape measure for $12.98. Okay? This is their cheapo. This is probably not measurements. Again, I don't know why you would buy this when you can get two. And this is a Pro 10, so that's what they're calling them. So Pro 10 is 10 feet of standout. This says Craftsman Pro 11. So obviously you're going to have 11. Oh, this says 14 feet. I don't know what that means then. So, but my point is you definitely want to spend the extra $7 on this. There's like no doubt about it. I, I like this tape measure, though, to be honest with you. I love the rubber all over it. These are the kind I like. It's just I don't know why it's so much money. Right? If these drop to, like, seven ninety eight or even nine ninety eight, you know. And I like the white blade. I like it better than the black blade. That's for sure. You don't know. All right, so here's uh, $17.98. So, again, um, this has the hook shield. Hyper-improved blade coating. All right, so they got some new tapes that I haven't seen. It, and they have a really wide blade on it, if you've noticed, uh, these craftsmen. I don't want to spend too much time on tape measures. Or, um, but this one, too, it had a pretty wide blade. See how wide that is? And these, these are nice, guys. These, these have some nice... Um, I like the um, the measurements on here. The reading, oh, oh, that ain't good. That was a little flimsy. I bet you. They, yeah, this has that. Definitely a stronger tape here, um, and it has good markings also. Very nice, bold, bold, and clear. Yeah, seventeen ninety eight. Again, guys, for you know the people who like the craftsman stuff. These are good. If you want my opinion, nothing beats the Milwaukee Magnetic. And again, uh, I'm not playing Milwaukee stuff here, but you got Magnetic, 12 feet of standout, all right? Um, you got the finger hook, the finger stop, and um, and these are 14 feet of standout, and they're $2 cheaper, all right? But the Magnetic and the finger stop, I think... We'll put them a little bit over the edge, in my opinion. And I just like them. I, think I, I like them. I like the way they feel better. But that's an option. All right, so they got a 40-foot. A look at this little one, guys. Now, we saw that one at Home Depot, right? You get a tape measure and one of these, right, for 30 bucks. It's a little, little expensive. Um, and I wouldn't be surprised if this is the same one, guys, as the DeWalt one. All right, I'm going to hit that. Do you guys see that? There's that white... Can you see that? Let's see. I'm going to put it on Zoom. Now, I don't know how good it works live, okay? As you can see, I'm a good... Well, it's going to tell me how far away I am. Oh, thank you, whoever. I appreciate that. Oh, it shut off on me? Oh, there it is. All right. Can you see it? You see it? You see that red dot? I think you guys can see it. All right. I'm going to hit it. And it didn't work. There's only one button on it. I mean, what the heck's the problem here? Oh, I might have to hit the side. Let me try it one more time. Uh, you see that red dot? See that red dot? I'm going to leave it pressed in now, see if that does anything. No. All right, so... All right, I swear this is the last time we'll try it. I'm going to hit the side now. 
You see that red dot? Oh, sorry guys. You're probably looking at feet. I see the red dot? You see that? Ding, 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 ding. I'm playing Christmas music. I, I can't hit it hard enough. If it's the side button, which it probably is, I can't hit it. I can't hit it. The plastic like stops me from hitting it. But anyway, it does 40 feet. I don't know why they would do a side button. You want to make this deep. If you got a hit up here, that can't be. But it has to be. I'm sorry I'm taking time with this, but it's if, don't buy this if that's the case. I can tell you that. Because if you have to use this and you're holding it and now you got to hit over here, that's annoying. I mean, I don't know what else to do here. Oh, there it is. You got to leave it pressed in. So that's 508 inches. No, I want it feet, baby. All right, 508 inches. Let's get it. Oh, that's so that's how you change. If you're doing inches or feet, so do the calculations. 508 inches on, on that part from that white box. What is that? Do the math. 508. The winner uh, gets. All right. So what else we got? A hose reel for 99. All right. I don't want to spend too much time here. Oh, this is a good deal, guys. Wow. This is a nice little set. All right. You get a um, a 20 ounce steel hammer. This this was a good idea. You get a steel hammer. Okay, if this actually drops down in price at some point, I might get it. I actually like this hammer too. Um, so yeah, you get a, uh, a 20 ounce steel hammer and a 13 inch flat bar. Again, you'll be using this flat bar, guys, more than they're they are just awesome. Whenever you got to pry something, I use them to scrape under my deck. Um, you know, the, the grass underneath my deck, sometimes, but I got a new scraper I got to tell you about. They're really awesome. Oh, they're going through these guys. All right, these Craftsman Aviation Snips for ten bucks. Um, I bought a pair of the Milwaukee's that were ten bucks, and I lost them. I don't know what the hell happened to them, but they look like they're doing pretty good. This guy's pissing me off. I'll tell you that. Four ninety-eight. Other than that, that's twenty-nine bucks. All right. Uh, Fourteen bucks for a ratcheting screwdriver. All right. Here's the the poor man's screwdriver set. All right. Um, you get you get a pretty big um, flathead here. But in the eight-piece screwdriver set, you get a couple stubbies for fifteen bucks. Uh, I don't know. You have to see. See what you like. All right, they got some, some skill stuff here, but nothing too... Oh, look at this. They did a great job here. No one's in this store on a Saturday during Christmas. There's nobody here. Well, I don't want to say nobody. There's Actually, I see a few people. That's, I see a few people down there, but definitely not jumping. Like, um, we saw that great deal, right, online. Now, hopefully that's in store. I think it's $29.99. You get a DeWalt 10-inch... 60 tooth fine tooth blade and a 32 tooth blade unless this is the same thing for seven yeah it is so this is a good deal too guys now all right this is a craftsman blade all right if you want to pay another 12 dollars and get that dewalt blade but where are you going to find and this is this is really a good price guys i don't know how good these blades are um you know obviously it's not a carbide blade here Maybe the DeWalt are carbide blades. I don't really remember. But anyway, a 60 tooth and a 24 tooth. I think the DeWalt was a 60 and a 32. But anyway, um, nice, guys. For the table saws, for the miter saws, um, 1798. This should be doing a little bit better. Oh, I saw Mommy kissing Santa's on. Oh, here's a seven and a quarter. Irwin. You know, Irwin's got a pretty... Dare Definitely um, another company that Stanley Black and Decker bought a few years ago, and they kind of have maintained them as a, a more high-priced brand. Um, I can't recommend this though, 24 tooth. I mean, 
I'm not saying I can't recommend it, but I won't get it. I'd get a 40 tooth Diablo two two pack for 14 bucks. All right, here's another Craig. They had a, a couple Craig kits over at um, the pocket hole kit. Some company just sent me one. Um, I have to open it. Oh, and here's a eight piece clamp set for 30 bucks. All right, guys, this is a great, great price. As you know, DeWalt has a set, right? It's only a four piece set, usually the DeWalt, and it's usually $32. All right, so here's an eight piece for three dollars less and you, you know you're getting um some clamps you're getting two um two inch clamps here okay you're getting two handy clamps here and you're getting um two 12 inch right trigger clamps um and two six inch all right so great great for 29 bucks guys this will really set you up i mean you have you have two 12s you got two sixes you know they do sell the dewalt little ones for like five bucks maybe or six bucks a piece if you want those really small ones i think they're three inch but this is this is a good price guys and if that drops and at any time i would jump on it in a hot second in my opinion all right what else we got work pro all right, 2498. I'm not gonna. All right, let's start. I'm, I'm kind of sick of this. I want to get to the power tools. All right, here's the Irwin. I got a little nice. I like this little mini hacksaw. Ten bucks. Lennox too. Lennox. I like Lennox. I like the little multi screwdriver. Oh, they got a nice little. Um, all right. Um, 12 piece and a 13 piece. The 12 piece. Um, Recip blade. This is 25 bucks. Again, I can't. Not when those Diablo sets. I think there was a 14 piece Diablo. Um, you know, these are not carbide. No way. Um, and this is a 13 piece for 89 bucks. All right. It's a lot of money. Um, made in the USA. I've actually talked to people who really like the Lennox hole saws, um, hole saw kits. So, but I don't know much about them. I would look at the sizes you want, okay? Because we know Milwaukee has one on sale, right? For twenty-nine or thirty-nine bucks, that's pretty similar. I think it might be a nine-piece, but we've done deals. But ninety dollars again. If you're using them a lot, go crazy. Oh wait, this might be. I know. Oh, but this is a good. This is good too, though, guys. For fifteen bucks, check this out. For fifteen bucks, all right. So you're getting a seven and a quarter inch, right? Um, for the people that have the seven and a quarter inch miter saws, don't be afraid. Do not be afraid. But you get a, a 40 tooth. So this is good for the guy that has the seven and a quarter inch miter and the seven and a quarter inch circular. And they're not really doing a lot of fine cutting. We're just cutting two by fours for 15 bucks. You know, put the 40 tooth on the miter and put the 24 tooth on your circular saw. Not bad. We don't have Makita here, my man. I wish we did. This this company has really grown pretty quickly. Um, wow, it's beautiful. They got a nice setup here. Let's look at some power tools. What is this? A little works table for 99 bucks, guys. Listen, get that Dewalt folding table for 69. Now I know not everyone. Can get it for 69 well you can't just got to put a different zip code in um in texas i don't know what what's going on in texas but in texas they're selling them for 69 bucks but i think everybody got one who wanted one i did that video a couple weeks ago um let's just walk down here they got garbage cans here for 29 bucks 17 dollar rake a plastic cheap rake 17 dollars is nuts all right um yeah when these drop i want to grab one of these but i don't know if they're ever gonna all right let's go look at some freaking tools oh uber charge oh yeah it's a hip i'm in oh thank you and i appreciate that whoever gave that there 
I know my man Slayer, mate. He's a great... Chaka, of course. Chaka, you got to comment after this video so I can get you back up there. I, I have to have a comment and then hit that. Again, look, guys. We saw that. <laughs> I'm, I'm happy we stopped here. So we got those Milwaukee demolition gloves. Now, we also have those performance gloves and those... I forget what they're calling the new ones, but anyway, they're $9.98. All right? And if you want to get the $14.98 demolition gloves... Uh, are you kidding me? These are like the $4 um, Milwaukee Cut Level 1 gloves. Now, obviously, different type of glove, but really thin. $20 they want for that. I don't, you know, Lowe's announces its earnings next week. I don't know how they're going to beat or meet these numbers, but they always seem to do it. But, all right, here's some cool. Oh. I just tripped over that. I just tripped over that. All right, let's start. Let's see if we can find... Oh, at 5.98. This is nice. We saw this. I'm sure they're going to have the same stuff here as last time. All right, I want to start a good point here. All right, let's just start here. All right, what is this? 47-piece. 60-piece. Uh, this is 20 bucks. And this is 10 bucks. No, I wouldn't get any of that. $69 here for a drill. I'd go I'd go to Walmart for 49. Someone told me that that um, new heart drill driver in store was $49. Now I can tell you if that was 49 bucks, um, they're gonna and they're gonna kick some major butt with that drill. I'm not saying it's great, but you know, $49, but anyway, 69 bucks for this. Again, there's no value here. Uh, we'll have to see what they have here. And now if, if you want to, if you have a Lowe's gift card and you have to spend the, say you got a hundred dollar gift card, get the DeWalt brushless for $30 more with two batteries. You're only getting one battery here too. And it's brushed. All right. Now I would probably go and get the atomic at home Depot but I'd probably get the Milwaukee over all of them, but don't don't get this. This is a nice price, guys, 20 bucks, all right? Um, and this will fit on your Veristack, and, um, well, I don't know. This is IP53 rated. I don't know if this is actually part of their Veristack. Um, what size is this? Oh, it's a 17-inch. So the Milwaukee is a 20-inch, though, for 20 bucks. All right, so that's where it's kind of hard. Again, it's the same price. This is 17 inches. The Milwaukee's 20 inches. But um, uh, they both have that seal. All right? I mean, this is fine. I like it. You know, the DeWalt's are yellow. This is, It's exactly the same as the DeWalt. But I don't think this is part of that Veristack system. Usually it says it. Uh, IP53 rated. Okay, so I don't know if the Milwaukee is IP rated at all. So that might give this a little bit of an advantage. But this is a nice little box, guys, for 20 bucks. Yeah, there's no clips on it. Yeah, there is clips. Maybe this connects to this, like the Milwaukee. If you, if you know the Milwaukee organizer, it has clips also, but it really only connects to other ones of these. So that might be what this is. Man, I'm sweating in here. Oh, here's a cobalt. Yeah, I would go with this over that Craftsman, guys. All right, obviously a lot more value here. They're saying $137. All right, so this one gives that Husky a little bit of run for their money. All right, I think the, the Husky was 28 a piece, and this is 24. It could be a 24, I don't quite remember. But um, you got a lot of, you know, over there, you would get either get metric or SAE. You get both of them here. One fifty nine for this, both brushless. This isn't a bad deal, but you only get one battery. Um, again, I would spend twenty dollars more and get the brushless um, Makita, right? One seventy nine for brushless Makita two tool set. So, and I hate doing this, guys, comparing it to Home Depot, trust me. But, you know, you're kind of watching for to get, you know, way, the deals. What's, but 
I mean, I don't know. I just want you to make the best decision, right? You know, again, I think they're going to have that pack out with the Milwaukee brushless drill driver impact with two batteries and the pack out box, right? For 199. So uh, again, I'm uh, tough. Here's a bigger I don't it's a lot of hand tools here. I'm getting a little fed up. 230 piece. I talked about this on that video. This isn't a bad deal, guys. All right? I think this will this will drop though. This usually is 44 bucks. Um, again, a lot of variety, but it looks like you get 230 pieces and you don't get a half inch nut driver. So that gets me a little hot and bothered. They don't want to include those half inch nut drivers. All right, 39 bucks for a 63 piece. Again, 227. Where is that set? I like this, guys. Um, but you can get the Husky for 398 So $200 cheaper. That being said, you do get a pegboard here, but I don't know if that's worth. And this is nicer, but I don't know if $200 nicer. But these aren't bad, guys. I, I kind of opened one of these up last time. Check my last Lowe's video. John Rice, thank you, my brother. William Logan, thanks, man. William, I appreciate that, brother. Mike Wilson, what's up? Um, and this is a great deal, too, guys. Um, EJ Demon, he has a lot of Instagram posts on these. Again, you know, real nice, not too heavy, soul horses, 30 bucks. Um, I think these were usually, I think these usually like 40 bucks a piece. So not a bad deal. And this isn't really bad if it's, well, this isn't, I said 20, there's no way. That's from the other side. This is kind of expensive. It's not bad. Yeah, 39.98. So you can get two of these for almost the price of the folding table from DeWalt, but you know the dewalt folding table is much better but whatever if you kind of maybe need two of them all right here's some more general that's come on i'm sick of it um 798 again a little little expensive uh, i believe the milwaukee is a 46 inch okay and it's 798. Again, I'm not saying the Milwaukee is so so great, but um, I know you get the soft closed drawers. You don't get them here. I, just expensive at Lowe's. What can I tell you? I mean, you're you're not getting a lot unless there's sales. Some I'll be honest with you though. The Lowe's when Lowe's has sales, they are really crazy. They are like kick butt crazy. When they have sales but they're regularly we get you just really have to wait out guys until they go on sale all right so here's a 129 piece set for 59 bucks all right forget about that 35 dollar 227 piece that's gone so you know you only get four wrenches here you still get both those allen wrenches you get one screwdriver instead of two but you get a quarter wrench and a three eighths 92 ratchet here and a bunch of sockets guys 12 and 6 points for 15 i mean i would get this over the craftsman um one and i think these are some good buys guys i mean 13 bucks and again you know i was talking about the channel lock a little bit um and not with the plier because channel lock does make good pliers but i hate those blue grips and you either like them or you love them i mean you either hate them or you love them but i like these kind of grips um Mark has one of these um, pliers from Cobalt, and they they really feel like they're made really well. All right, so I mean, twelve ninety eight, you're saving thirty five percent. These are good. I would go for, if you want the hand tools. They're they're gonna have a little bit of, of an advantage at the lows. That, that's what I would get here. And again, this is a good deal, right? We just saw the Milwaukee. They had a two piece for fifteen. Here you're getting a three piece for twelve. And again, they got that really nice grip on them all right it makes them feel really well made and, and sturdy and again here's a little plier set for 18 bucks good i mean you get a needle nose you get joint groove you got you know nice set guys this is a nice set for 17.98
really nice set and they've have sold quite a few of them for it for here anyway and that i just did one more and then we should be by the power tools a lot of volume here okay a lot, lot of volume what is this 62 piece for 10 bucks uh you know how i feel they're, they're not bad they're not great they're throwaway much like the ryobi here's an impact wrench for 99 i don't want to go too nuts here I'm back. I don't know what happened. It always does that now. It shuts off on me at around 30 minutes in. Then I have to click it back on. All right, here's a, a 20 piece. You get that nice little bottle opener, too, for 20 bucks, guys. And you get the um, precision set here, a small set. This is a home run. I get this over the Craftsman in a heartbeat. They had an eight piece for 15 bucks, right? The eight piece Craftsman. No bottle opener, no precision. Even get, look at that. And you can try me, but you, look at the size of that. You're pretty big screw, 20 bucks, go nuts. All right, here's their version of the Milwaukee. So this is $11 compared to 20, all right? So if you're looking for some value, this is half the price of the Milwaukee, all right? And they sold quite a few. There's people that just want, all right, Craftsman here. All right, let me just kind of move around. But I thought this was a great, this is the same one. I just posted this on, um, on, on Instagram, okay? I posted the DeWalt version of this that's going to be sold at Tractor Supply, okay? It's the same price, but I believe the DeWalt is a 227 piece, okay? So I like it. I like the setup. I would get the tough system over this. All right, only because of the tough system. All right, but this is for the Ver the, the Versa. I keep calling it Vera stacked. The this is for the Versa stacked. Um, not bad. I like it. I like the setup. They haven't sold any, so don't be surprised if this really goes on sale. Okay, don't. We're gonna keep our eye on this. So guys, you guys got a job to do. Let's all keep our eyes on this set. All right, because it doesn't look like they sold one of these freaking things. I mean, I packed all the way in the back like a tight little wiener package. There's three. There's got to be 25. No, there's got to be 30 of them here. There's at least 30 of these here. Here's all the stuff. 71 piece. And this is, don't forget, guys, this is quarter inch, three eighths and half inch. And what's cool about it, it's very heavy. <laughs> It's heavier than that craft than that cobalt set. I could tell you that in a heartbeat. But here's all your three eight stuff. So you got a three eight drawer, you got a quarter inch drawer, and then you got your half inch drawer. I love that. That's great. Good. Stay away from these freaking gloves. And what do we got here? Waffle. Waffle cock. Oh, well, you got some weave packing. Alright, let's look at some tools. Let's look at some tools. All right, here is our famous $35 set. All right. There's also this one. This is a 200, and I think this one has wheels. Yeah, so this is $99 too, guys. I wish this one would have went on sale. Oh, and this one's open, so we can take a look at it, guys. But don't tell anybody. I'll leave real quick if you tell some. All right, relax. All right, I opened it up. I can't really go too nuts here because it's it's scrapped. It's in here like a. All right, but yeah, it's like a little suitcase. I hope this goes on to if this goes to thirty five bucks. Let me know too. I'm gonna block this one up, and we can play with it a little bit. So again, you got this, you know, kind of just like your suitcase, right? Is that as high as it lifts? No. All right, so that's as high as it lifts. All right, so, you know, pretty cool. You know, you think for the size of this, it would have more than 200 pieces in it. Um, but it only has, there's a lot of these here. That one dude's, like, he bought the entire store. Because I think they only have, like, it looks like they only have, like, 12, 13 here. Um, smart man. Um this is a little bit different set guys this is a household a household tool set now why they thought that someone who 
you know, this is a household set. Why do they think they it needed wheels? I don't know. Because you really don't need to be transferred. You, you know, you're going to have this at your house. I mean, if you need a hammer, you open it up, take a hammer. But whatever. Uh, there's some good stuff in here. It's very similar. But you got pliers. It's a totally different type of set. It looks like you only got one ratchet in it here. And it's probably a 3 8 ratchet. But, guys, you got some good stuff. I'm, I'm looking at it right now. I, I don't know if you can see it. But you got a tape measure. Okay, you got a utility knife, scissors, some screwdrivers. Um, joint groove, you right? You got a needle nose pliers, a bunch of pliers, adjustable wrench, a lot of screwdrivers, precision. You get wrenches, sockets. This is a nice set, guys, for a hundred bucks. I, I, I'm, I'm actually shocked that this is a hundred bucks. Um, and to be honest with you, I think this is a better deal than this. I just think there's, you know, I don't know. It matters what you're looking for. They're two different types of things, so I shouldn't have said that. But and me personally, I'd rather. So, yeah, they jumped the prices of the cobalt batteries. All the batteries went up. All right, they went up. Bring it up. All right, yeah, there's the inside of 227. All right, so this used to be 50. Now it's 59. The um, t the two amp hour went from twenty bucks to thirty bucks, and I believe the one point five went from fifteen bucks to twenty bucks. All right, don't know what's up with that, but that's what's going on. I'm sweating. I really am sweating. I want to get one of these Nest thermometers. That's my Nest thing, guys. Amazon Eco Show, right? I this is gonna be. Uh, $99. I think it's actually cheaper here then. I thought I did a post on that. And I'm going to be honest with you guys. Google. I, I have Alexa. But I have the Google in my car. Alright. The Mitsubishi has, has the Google you know, ask a question thing. And the Google is so much better than Alexa. But you know it, they're kind of late to the game. So, and here's a lot of this uh, uh, you know We'll, we'll listen. If I find some good deals on that during the holidays, we'll show. I'm not gonna go too crazy. All right, what do we got? Buy one, get one free. Okay. Yeah, and I'm I'm not too look. Now over at Home Depot, you can get a 12 amp hour 21700 cell Milwaukee battery and a 8 amp hour. For one ninety nine, and obviously return one or the other. Here they want a hundred bucks for a four. Crazy. All right, so let's try to do this as quick as we can. This should be ninety nine. It is online. I guess it's one nineteen in store, but maybe. Uh, again, we kind of went over these. One fifty nine and one. We talked about this. Pretty good deal. Um, you know, not bad. I'd go with the bottom. I think they're both the same price. I don't know why they don't have the price differences here. But we just went over these yesterday. All right, let's see what else. All right, so here's a 45 piece. I mean, this is the tough grip. So this isn't even the flex torque or the max grip. And they want $18 for this. All right, no tours in zone. Get your bits at the wall. I mean... We went over these, um, yeah, 798 bucks. You're gonna pay. Again, a nice, definitely a nice set, but 800 bucks. I mean, I don't even think, I think the Milwaukee is like 598. This is $200 more than Milwaukee. Again, not saying Milwaukee's great. And I don't think with the Milwaukee, you, you get that touch pad, but a lot of new stuff here guys a lot of channel lock they should have that that set all right here's some more cobalt all right we heard about oh you guys saw the husky right the husky torque wrench um half inch okay um 59 for the three eighths here so it's ten dollars cheaper 
with the Husky and the half inch is 79, it's 59 for the Husky. There's a 189 set, so just to let you know. All right, so here's a 189 piece. Now I want, this isn't really a mechanics tool set, but this is 200 and, yeah, actually that's what they're calling this. They're calling this a mechanics tool set, all right? Instead of 227, this is 189, all right, pieces. And they want, look how much. All right, so maybe this is better. It looks like there's a lot more deep well sockets here and screwdrivers and a, I wouldn't say a lot more, but maybe some more wrenches. See, they don't have the fill with the set. All right, perfect example. And here's a hundred piece set. Um, homeowner tool chest for 179. All right, here's some sockets, 1298. Uh, 59 bucks. We know about that Husky Deep Well Impact set for 29 bucks. You, you come to Lowe's, you're talking all hand tool stuff, unfortunately, which is great. Don't get me wrong, but we want to talk about some power tools. All right, 150, all right, 249, all right, $249 for a six piece set. All right, so you can kind of compare this to the Ryobi. And here is an eight tool for 300. We talked about it yesterday, right? And Porter Cable has something similar, but it's 279. All right, so pretty much the same exact tools. All right, but if you don't mind having Porter Cable on them, you can save 20 bucks. That's good. May I help you, sir? I'm good, thank you. Sure. Yep. So let me go over here, hold on, yep. 988, okay, that's pretty good. 27 piece. This is all the tough grip stuff. All right. Um, guys, the $99 freak is great. It's brushed. All right. But you have to just think about what else is out there. Get the icon. Somebody said to get the icon. Oh, look at this little set. Multi blade hole saw, seven and one. They're doing okay. And here's some, some blades for $9.88. Oh, this is what you got to get, guys. I talked about this at Lowe's probably three or four times. I think this is one of the best sets for $14, okay? And what I would do, because remember, guys, it only, you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight, uh, two-inch, but you got a couple in here, too. I would spend 30 bucks probably and get two of these and you got an 80 piece set all right and you got two removable storages you got six nut drivers oh you got two more up here so you got 10 you get a lot of two inch bits in here you know it's not a big set um you know looking at it but there's no you know you got the basics you got t25s t20s t15s uh you got roberson look at those you got flat heads in there you got porks phillips and then you got your bunch of two inch bits and you got some more two inch bits here. You got the adapter. I like it, I don't know. And they look like um, they haven't been selling, which is a shame. I like it. All right, we saw the, I would get this over that Craftsman in a heartbeat. It's just, it's 65 feet over 40 and you're paying $10 extra. And again, Bosch is really the leader in these laser measures. All right, $449, guys. This is not a bad deal, all right? Um, but, you know, you're paying for the quality, and you're paying, uh, and the, the stand is really nice, guys. Um, but, you know, there's going to be some higher RPM table saws and some higher rip capacities with some others, but this is a Bosch, and a lot of people, you know, this is really quality here, but... You know, Bosch really good table saws. All right. Oh, here's yeah, 229. You can get the rigid for 99 bucks, guys. I think no, I think the rigid is 129. The Ryobi is 99 for their forced pro. But the compare this to the rigid because the Ryobi, I think, only goes up to 30,000 BTUs or something. Um, all right, here's a table saw mumbo jumbo. Here you get the stand. And the table saw. Okay. 
I don't know what the hell the price is. Oh, here's that. Whoa, see, we saw this yesterday, guys. Online, this is $29. So if you, you go to your Lowe's store and you want to buy this, and this is, again, I recommend it. And again, yeah, it is the 32. So you get a, you get a 24 tooth and a 32, and a you get a 40, excuse me. With the Craftsman, you get a 60 tooth and a 24 tooth. With this one, you're getting a 60 tooth and a 32 tooth. You're paying $12 extra. I would go with this, no doubt about it. All right, great price. Again, you can put the, um, you know, you got a table saw and a miter saw. Put the 60 tooth on the miter, put the 32 tooth on your table saw, you're good as gold. And here is a, um, an 80 tooth, 12 inch blade. Okay, not bad. And they sold a lot of them. That's a great deal too, guys. An absolute great deal. All right. I know everyone's into some of these carbide blades now, but sometimes it's not necessary. All right. This guy's pissing me off. This guy's farting around. Let's go down here and we'll work our way back. That guy's really up my line, my last nerve, okay? These spider sets, guys, I don't know. I, I hope to help. Oh, yeah, here's, like, this is that trigger set. Yeah, I'd get the other one. So this is priced just like the DeWalt. And why would you get this? Can you tell me why you would get this? Because you're getting four. You're getting the same exact trigger clamps with the other one. You're getting two 12s and two 6s, okay? Unless these can do more clamping force than the other ones. I don't know. You're going to have to read the up close. They've sold a shitload of these. Excuse my language. And they haven't sold any. I don't, there might be. There has to be some kind of difference. But Spider finally got into Lowe's. If you don't know them, they're a new company kind of. Really nice people uh, I'm on, on Instagram. I think they're independently owned. I don't think like any of the big... Yeah, I think they're, you know, they, they're, I don't know, guys, it's a shame, you know, you get, I, I don't know, I've, I've talked to a lot of people on Instagram who have used this stuff and absolutely love it, but again, one review can kind of kill you maybe, oh, 20, wow, this is, all right, guys, everybody back up, all right, I'm going to do, so, every, who's here, there's 200, wow, 300, wow, this is the biggest we're coming real close to the biggest and guys i appreciate you coming on i'm not really reading the um i'm not reading the comments here and i apologize but i want to read some of this stuff guys this is a great deal i'm not a big fan it's not that i'm not a big fan of this tape measure you you've heard me talk about it a few times um for the 35 dollars price it's insane now again it was always a little bit cheaper here at Lowe's than it was on Amazon. Not much, like $3. I paid $35 with tax for a 16-foot Plumpkin tape measure. But we talk, they, they can't sell these at all. They can't sell them. You know, they, they went on Instagram and they're trying to give influencers some, you know, stuff to, to promote these. But in a week, they had these on the market. And not one of them is even sold at $24. I'm going to, you know, I would probably still go with that magnetic, guys. Because, th again, these look really nice. I'm going to, you know, this is a lot of lipstick here. All right. They got really nice color combinations with the orange and the black. Okay. Um, you know, they got this fancy metal protectant here, you know, to for your, you know, stop it your 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 blade stop here you know just you know you got the double measurements but the big thing is the black blade right every it's it's kind of new let me see if i can show you all right it's 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 not a for 12 dollars a piece like if you buy any of those craftsmen all right now and the only reason i'm recommending this for 24 dollars is for one reason all right because one i'll tell you one thing I had the 16 footer. They promote 14 feet of standout. They're full of crap. And all you have to do is look at my Instagram post. And everybody else commented, yeah, I get around 11. I get 10. I got 12. 
So if you're looking for 14 feet of standout with this, you're not going to get it. But all things being considered, it's a pretty compact, a lot of rubber. You heard me talk about that Craftsman one, and it, it's really the same price. You know, that Craftsman one was 12 bucks with no measurements on both sides. But the only thing that this has is really this is this fancy black blade. All right? Um, it, if, it, if it gets dirty, it can get a little bit hard to read. It can get a little dirt on here. But, um, I mean, I, I can't believe they dropped the price already. But great, the, the, you know, for 12 bucks, I would get the Milwaukee because you got the magnetic and you got the finger stop. You don't have the finger stop and you don't have magnetic with this. Um, so, but, you know, if it drops to $19, get them. All right, that was a great. Oh, how's it going, Blitz 67? Yeah, no one's even interested in those tapes. We're talking about the Metabo already. All right. Hey, what's up, Carl? I'm Dustin. What's up, buddy? Apex has killed a lot of good tools over here. All right, how we see? What's up, my man? Jed Mulk. All right, what do we got here? A twenty? What? No. All right, eight ninety-eight. What is this down here? Wow. All right, you only get one blade. All right. So with the Dewalt. All right. You got two blades. Right. You got it. I think an 80 what was the dewalt i just read it but you got two blades for 59 bucks um you get one only with this so i would i, I don't know everything is hitachi to matabo see so you, when you kind of see that you know this is basically a hitachi kind of blade for the most part maybe it's different i don't know but if you look at a lot of their miter saws now they're exactly the same and the table saw. I'll actually show you that in a second. Um, I don't know. I don't know why they did that. I'm not a big fan of that. You know, Hitachi, I thought, made a great purchase with the Metabo company. You know, you got your low-priced stuff or your mid-grade prosumer stuff, and then you got your Metabo. And for some reason, they combined them. I, I don't know what the point of that was. Because uh, some of the stuff, you know, you saw that black um, impact driver, right? Maybe we'll see it down here. They got gift cards. Yeah, so the spider stuff. Um, yeah, they got the porter cable. There it is. All right. So this is an eight tool combo. All right. You get a four amp hour battery with this one, too. I don't know if you got a four with the Craftsman. Uh, you guys would know, but you get basically the same tools here. All right. Except it's $20 cheaper. Um, you know, we're talking about the heart stuff. Um, as I was talking about that and investigating the whole heart thing, um, believe it or not, Porter Cable was supposed to possibly go over to Walmart, but I guess they didn't wanted their own brand. What's funny about the heart stuff too? Uh, you guys know Hearts colors used to be red and black, right? That was their color. So you look at all their hammers, their old tape measures, their old all their old stuff, red and black. Now they went over to Walmart white and blue so i guess they wanted their own identity their own brand i don't know where the hell to go next all right 199 pretty good price this is a 12 inch miter saw it's probably not sliding yeah it's not a sliding so but if you don't need a sliding you got a five-year warranty you do get the laser marker um, here's some nailers. Uh, the good, you know, not bad. Again, I online, I, I could have swore this was $69 online. So, unless the store hasn't done it yet, or I'm not really sure. Um, you know, I don't want to waste too much time talking about the same tools that we do every time we're here with this. Um, I'll show you. Here's the screw gun. Um, oh, guys, it's a really good deal. I put it up um 179 here this is 149 on amazon guys and this is fairly new so is their new router uh this is i've seen this as low as 139 on amazon and from what i heard this is pretty much i think one of the best in the business all right um uh, i don't even know if, know if milwaukee's is out yet to be honest with you but um they're all good you know uh, someone did a 
a video and told me about it and they said they did the water best all right so here's that deal so we talked about a couple of this the bigger brushed um combo kits all right this is the one that we talked about right 769 bucks all right now this is empty thank god must have took all the tools out of here but that's good because now we can kind of get a, a nice look at this all right you got pockets here for you know screwdrivers hammers you know maybe a 24 inch box level or something i don't know whatever you want to put in there you got nothing in the back you got a nice look it's you know a suitcase type thing um this goes up pretty high all right um i don't know kind of kind of loose for my liking but not bad um you know you have to find this is display um there's probably yeah there's a big pocket here i can't take this off but there's a huge pocket right underneath here and this is where it says the wall and stuff all right um and i can't open this unfortunately you know uh, if you already have the tough system boxes we know about the 2.0 right so i think this is probably the better way to go uh, I'm not telling you to do that, of course. I don't know what the tough... I think the tough system... Um, Home Depot's doing the tough system version of everything you see here. Remember, you only get one brush, one brushless tool with this kit. And we knew something was up when this was $769. And it came with two 2 amp hour batteries. Here, that's what the thing looks like. All right. Um, but since they're kind of going to the 2.0... If uh, you want to go to this, I don't know. It's it's not as well made as I thought it was, but I don't know. It's not bad, I guess. Is this a handle too? I don't think so. It's a supports. Um, I don't know. It's hard to tell because there's nothing in it, and they all when there's nothing in them, they all kind of look. I don't know. I think it's okay. I don't think it's great. But I don't know if you can, I don't think you can buy this separately yet. Um, what is this? So this is the brushless. Again, the Atomic is smaller and it's the same price. All right, so I'd go with the Atomic, okay? And I think this comes with the 780 instead of the 771. No, it comes with the 771, so it comes with the real cheap drill driver. You got to pick up a ticket to get this thing. Look. I guess these things they expect to sell very quickly. I don't know. I don't know. $24 for this. Tough grip. See, remember, they're the only... Uh, Home Depot don't carry any of the tough grip stuff. Uh, Lowe's does, and they're actually putting them in that tough case for Lowe's. Um... Oh, $9.97 for the glasses. Get them. Guys, I'm wearing the Milwaukee's right now. And everything I said about these, I'm going to have to... You'll see during the video. I absolutely love them. They are so comfortable and so light. Um, they're not really great with the sun. I'll, I'll talk about them in another video. All right. $99. We know about that. Go the other way. What's this? $249 for this? No. See, this is a perfect example. Get the two point. They want two forty nine for this. I mean, are they on drugs? Listen, get the two point oh. It's it's. I think it's two twenty nine right now. But rumor has it it's going to be one ninety nine. Oh, these went down to nine. Oh, this is a great deal, guys. All right, so perfect. All right, and these are usually fifteen dollars. And the Walt is the only company that is including that half inch um, nut driver. All right. So, you know, what's great about it, and you always hear me talk about it, like, what's this guy's deal? You don't have to get a socket, you know? You, you can use your nut driver on your impact. You don't have to get a socket adapter. You don't have to go get a socket. So the, the half inch is great. Now, I wish, I don't like the magnetic that much. It's, it's fine. I like, you know, with them being open. Um, Ryobi makes, I like Ryobi's. Because I don't know if anyone else makes a half inch that's not magnetic or all that. All right, 20 bucks. You have the removable storage here. Uh, remember, Tough Grip is their, you know, remember, there's the real cheap stuff, then there's the Tough Grip, and then there's the Flex Torque. 
all right? They have an extra version at Lowe's. At Home Depot, you got the real cheap, then you got the max fit. So you got that mid-grade stuff here. I don't know where they're getting, you know, here's a 110 piece, guys. You, you, listen, it, this isn't worth it for a hundred. Get the, you can get for, you can get the Milwaukee 106 piece. All right, now I'm not saying that's great. And you got, definitely got, you got three inch here. You got two inch. All right, um, you got a lot more drill bits. These aren't titanium. I think these are that gold ferocious but these bits aren't as good all right as the um shockwave but anyway here's the flex grip so they they put these in the the flex grip the flex work also have um this tough case too all right so this is kind of a universal thing for craftsmen and dewalt this new bit case all right, you got the removable storage here. These are pretty much the same thing as the Mac fits, guys. Um, I haven't seen any um, flex torque, double torsion zone stuff, though. That's 20 bucks for a 50. It's not even, you leave them here. Uh, it's kind of embarrassing that they're charging for here. All right, we know about the 12 volt extreme stuff. For some reason, the impact wrench went up to 149 bucks. But maybe in store, you can still, yeah, in store, you can still get it for 99. So we just saw this yesterday, right, guys? Online, 149 in store. It's still saying 99. Um, it's it's okay, guys. It's not bad. I don't think you're getting 200 foot pounds, like it says, but maybe with a smaller, you know, bolt or something. Now, if you're looking at this stuff, go on. I got an, an email last night from Bosch talking about these two kits. In that advertisement, and it went from Bosch to Lowe's. It brings you to Lowe's site. They're calling this brushless kits. These are not brushless kits, guys. All right, just to let you know, these are brushed. So if you got that um, in the email yesterday saying that this is a brushless, these are brushless combo kits, that is not true, okay? Now they're actually, look at this light. I've never seen this light before. And this has probably been out a while, but I've never seen it actually in a store. Wow, ah, this is pretty darn bright. Um, you know what I feel about the batteries, good batteries, man. And they got the eight and I got they got the 12. All right, this you're gonna see guys. I like this at $129. All right, this is probably the best impact kit you're gonna get. Now I think it's back up to 149 on Amazon. This is, I'm gonna do a video probably in, within the next week of my ranking all the impact drivers. This is my opinion, all right? Now, that being said, you're gonna be a little shocked where this one comes in, because I don't think it's as well made as the original Freak, but all things being considered, okay? It's a great buy. Um, you know, it's got a lot of IPM, 4100 or 4200 IPM. The anvil is just awesome. I mean, I, I still you hear me talk about it a lot. I can't believe other companies haven't stolen this or gone to this. Well, thank you, guys. I can't believe it. That's probably the... Uh, I, guys, I wish I can look. And whoever donated, this is probably the most money <laughs> I've ever made in a live stream. I appreciate that, guys. Not, not necessary at all. And I don't want anything more than, like three four dollars i think i said five dollars in another video so i don't want to see anything with 20 25 50 that's absolutely just disgusting in my opinion um you know something over a dollar that's great but 25 50 bucks oh look at this monster that is beastly wow is this an this must be that 30 all right so they got some newer wow look at this little cute little impact uh went off just by picking it up i just picked it up that's all i did i picked it up you can't pick it up i'm leaving i'm getting out of here but look at all the all they're going up to all that metabo stuff all right i gotta get out of here the thing went off i just picked it up you saw me do it all i did was lift the freaking thing up they got balls all right, don't get this for 25. All right, let's go over here. We'll work our way back over there. I didn't do anything, sir. I just touched the something. Yeah, 
Well, you. Well, let's go. I thought the guy won. All right. We talked about this, guys. My Tom, yeah. All right, here's some of the, yeah, I mean, I just touched, picked something up. So 139, we know about this 129, right? Would uh, get the kit for 129. I put this picture up, nothing great, guys. This is the same thing kind of at Home Depot, except you got another option, all right? You only get one free, okay? Um, at Home Depot, you get two free, but you're spending an extra 100 bucks, but... Remember, that $299 kit is the Flex Vault. Here they're giving you brushed $299 kit with some brushless options. Okay? But not much. Uh, this is absolutely disgusting, if you ask me. Both of these. Now, I'm going to talk about that. Who, If somebody wants the two 5 amp hour battery starter kit, let me know. Because I have an amazing price on that. This is they can't set that they can't shut there's two guys trying to work on that alarm all right somebody knocked this isn't bad for 25 bucks guys but remember that milwaukee one is 20. and you might be just like what the heck milwaukee one's he talking about the one with the two milwaukee sockets right the two shockwave it's it's still 20 i believe they finally might have gotten rid of it um but this is 25. you get two nut drivers you get a long sock adapter two inch bits they don't they're, they're moving around um, and you get this fancy little bit adapter, but this isn't bad for 25 bucks, but I don't know. You do get two sockets, but you know, that cobalt set last Christmas was crazy, right? You got like six sockets came with it. Um, I'm trying to get back over there, guys. There's like a big meeting over there. I gotta fix that damn thing. Oh, well, we can look at this. Here's the brushed version. Oh. See, this is a lot of, you can't get any of these, guys. This is, for another five bucks, guys, you're getting nut drivers. You're getting um, removable storage. Um, $14.98 for this. I want. I mean, you get a couple drill bits here, but get that 40-piece. Um, this is 99 Again, there's no reason to get this when you can get the, the Freak 2. So... How you doing? But, um, yeah, here's some good deals. Wow, look at this, guys. Nail cutting. Okay. Okay. Here's some, here's the edge. Okay. Edge. Here's the Bosch cheap stuff. It's gotten really good in here. All right, those guys seem to have fixed the problem. $89 for two fours? All right, so obviously you want to go this way if you want to get the fours um, instead of paying $60 for one. Here's an SDS. I, this, I, I don't know if this has been out for a while. I never knew they made one. Uh, it's a 7 8 brushless um, for $169. All right, here's one of the deals. Now, they're giving a free miter saw. Okay, for two ninety nine. I don't know where that kit is. It might be online only, or that might be happening on Black Friday. But for two ninety nine, you're going to be able to get a cobalt combo kit. I think it's a five tool combo kit for two ninety nine. Everything's brushless, and you get the miter saw. Remember, the miter saw is two hundred and forty nine dollars itself. I'm pretty sure it was two ninety nine. You guys would probably know because I know I probably received ten messages from you guys. It's right. Is it two ninety nine or three ninety nine? I'm thinking two ninety nine. Um, but it's a, one of the really good deals. Now these aren't bad because you're getting a four tool brushless, and you get to pick another tool. All right. So all your options are brushless. Uh, these are made by Shervon, same people that make Skill. Um, they're, they're they're good. I mean, if you're looking at the Ryobi where you're getting brushed, you might get a couple more tools. But, you know, you're getting uh, impacts with sp speed selectors. Cobalt, very unappreciated value brand in my mind. Um, and it's undervalued and under-talked about only because I think people think it are hand tools. 
and you know kind of lower priced but they make some pretty solid power tools you know diy not you know professional but to get that brushless oh this is the pin nailer uh metabo makes some really well even hitachi did these are basically just renamed um hitachi nailers but hitachi made some really nice um the makita is much better if you're looking for a pin nailer i don't know what the price is but the 18 volt now remember makita makes a 12 volt pin nailer a lot of people don't know that but they do but yeah here's that 69 dollar metabo pin nailer all right um yeah, maybe that was a brad nailer over there i was thinking but some pretty good deals um th this is their framing nailer it's it's big guys i would definitely go with the um the wall no doubt it's big it's heavy i don't want this damn alarm to go off again the whole freaking thing's gonna fall down there's nobody in here all right i think we're pretty much i really wanted to show you this stuff all right so here's this the um hitachi stuff is kind of out of here now i don't see any so the samsung they were trying to get rid of it they were giving it away for 89 bucks for that brushless circular saw see this this is the ridiculous part this is 159 dollars for this impact driver guys I, I couldn't believe the quality of it. I'm like, and I, I knew it wasn't going to be sold for $99. But you get one battery, okay, for a brushless impact, really low IPM, low power. Um, oh, this is 149 Wow. All right, time out. All right, this is what I wanted to show, but the alarm went off. If, I, if this alarm goes off. All right. This is 149 bucks, guys. All right, um, IP56 rated. Now, if you're not familiar, um, Hitachi, Matabo, they're the only ones that are really doing these IP rated tools. Okay, so this can get a little bit wet. Remember, you just spend a $300 on your Milwaukee Fuel high torque impact wrench, and it starts raining outside. You just voided your contract or your warranty. All right, so this is a great idea, and this really, you know, Hitachi was smart doing this, and I think this was what they should have left with Metabo, because this is what pros want to see. If you want to do like, you know, Hitachi DIY, keep the Metabo for the, you know, the tradesman, the uh, contractor, because let me tell you, having IP rated tools is great, because these things get wet. You know, it gets wet. They get dropped into puddles. They fall. You know, um, I don't. I, I. This is beautiful. This is a really beautiful, comfortable impact wrench. I'm absolutely in love with this. I love these small ones. You know, I hope Milwaukee has to update. You know, Milwaukee's. Um, it's probably five or no more than that. Probably six or seven years old. Uh, they actually a couple years ago they made it actually a one key tool which surprised me because it's so old I'm, i was surprised but you know the 225 foot pound um impact wrench it's available three i mean this is a beautiful impact too i like this how much is this 199 dollars oh but this comes with one of those beefy batteries all right let me see something here because uh, i'll tell you this is a nice small impact driver all right first things first where's the shitter no i'm okay i'm just kidding i didn't have to go to the bathroom all right ip56 what kind of torque we got um specs uh it's beeping 3600 ipm why can't i find it's 3.3 pounds with a 3 amp hour battery. Can you believe that? 3.3, probably 2 pounds without it. 225 foot pounds of torque. All right, so it's similar to the old Milwaukee. Um, but I think a higher IPM. But yeah, 225 inch pounds. You don't get any batteries with it, it's bare tool. Uh, the impact driver. Yeah, you don't want to. This thing is a joke. Um, and that's the drill. Here's the impact. I think I might have even been looking at that as an impact. But here's the impact. Again, very cheaply made. Um, you know, it's just black. I mean, 
no way should you get this. It comes with like a 1.5 amp hour battery. Um, that will be a lot cheaper. All right, 199, and you get the multi volt battery. This is a pretty good deal. All right, this is the hammer drill. This is a great hammer drill kit here, guys. All right. Um, I wish I could find the impact. Oh, here it is. It's 199 too. Uh, let me just see the specs. I'm just excited because I haven't seen any of this, you know, Metabo full stuff. Um, all right, so you get a 5 amp hour battery and the 3 amp hour battery. All right, so they're giving you a multi volt 5 amp hour battery. All right, so it's a 5 amp hour 18 and a 2.5 amp hour 36 volt. And they're giving you a 3 amp hour battery. All right, you're getting your charger, you're getting your bag. I mean, this is a pretty good deal. If this drops to 179, it, it would be something I would really consider, guys. Uh, let's look at the torque, though. Um, so the battery's compatible with all that. 3,400 IPM, not that much. Guys, you heard my feelings on the IPM. I don't like anything really over 3,600. You know, I was just talking about the Bosch there for a second. But 4,100, 4,200, it's way too much torque. Uh, too much IPM, excuse me. It just spins way too fast. Um, with a couple fasteners I had to do with the with the shed, I, I, I got sick of using it because it would just spin right off of it. It wouldn't grip, it'd spin off of it. And then if I lowered it to speed two, I would lose a lot of torque. So don't get all mixed up with all this high IPM. It's good if there's like four speeds, all right? That's what's kind of good about, you know, some of these are now getting six speeds, like the Rigid. I think the Makita has like four or five speeds. Uh, but when you're limited to, it's a big drop off to get rid of that crazy IPM in torque. All right. Uh, 1,522. All right. So it's not really powerful, but it's powerful enough. 3,600. It's fine, guys. You know, we've gotten insanely just crazy with a lot of these torque numbers. Um, you know, you really don't need that for the most part. Um, yeah, not bad. I mean, I like the impact um, wrench a lot better. Um, and did they have a kit? Because I don't know if this has any speed settings. So even though it feels really nice and you get that five, I don't, I, there's no selector on this. That's just, that's just, that's crazy. So, uh, I take that back, even though it's still not bad because it is brushless and you get a five, but I mean, you don't even get a speed selector. But the impact wrench, I really like. And I don't know if that's IP. This might not be their top. I think they have a multi volt impact driver. That's like their top of the line. That's might, but this thing is beautiful, guys. This is a beautiful little small impact wrench, guys. Um, 225 foot pounds, 3,600 IPM. Good, good, solid numbers. And how much is the kit? I know Bear Tool. It's 149. I wish they made it in a kit. I wish they made it in a kit, but they don't. Now the thing with Bosch, people ask me about their impact wrenches. They haven't made an impact wrench in years, and especially a high torque. They did make a very similar freak. Old freak impact wrench that wasn't, you know, didn't it had no collet, but it, would, it looked exactly like the old freak. I have it. I've done a couple of videos on it, but I think with this anvil, they've kind of just said that we're not dealing with impact wrenches. It's not their thing. You know, a lot of automotive people do not really use Bosch stuff, so I think they really kind of, you know, stay away from the impact wrench. I mean, they do have a high torque, but again, this is how far we've come their high torque impact wrench is like 400 foot pounds because they haven't updated it i think it's brushed so um but again really i like this impact driver a lot really thin handle you got that bluetooth capability i don't know how good that's doing you know i don't know how good bosch is doing period um i think they make a lot of their money in the diablo stuff and you know the hardcore sds stuff and you know yeah, this is part of the kit too. See if they made a brushless one of these. The they've had one of these out for a while, Bosch. Um, and they have a bandsaw for 149. All right. Um, I think really that's about it. Let's work our way back down this way. Um, I had a 
uh, the DeWalt stuff we know about, guys. We know about the, the kits. Um, you know, that 2.0, I think, is already available at Home Depot. Again, I don't know why they, they vary so much. Like, some, some stuff's at... Oh, oh, that's the heat gun. Some stuff is at Lowe's, and some stuff is at Home Depot, right? Like, we the, the, the 2.0 tough system, I guess, well, they don't really carry the tough system here. That makes sense. They carry more of the that T-stack stuff. But, oh, here's the 8 amp hour, 149. And usually this is 79 bucks. Don't be surprised that goes down. That's why I was telling you about those jackets, guys. They want $40 for their power supply, power source. It's crazy. Um, Bosch charger. Yeah, here's that multivolt battery. This is either a four or an eight. This is an eight amp hour battery for $119, guys. So their batteries, batteries have gone down tremendously. They want only $89 for that five amp hour battery, guys. For the Metabo. I think these are 21,700 cells. But I, I can't tell you 100%. Because I don't really follow the Metabo. But from the size of the battery, I think these are 21,700s. So, again, awesome. Cheap. I mean, 119 is pretty good. All right. I don't know if they have a two-pack. Um, there's Bosch's power supply. All right. Um, here's the 12-volt, what we've pretty much have nothing left here 149 guys for the kit um compared to the dewalt i know a lot of people talk about the bosch and they like it better so i don't know i don't own this i know it's definitely more compact um and i think it comes with an extra attachment this is a five in one the milwaukee is a four in one okay um and it's cheaper um, but I don't think this is brushless. I could be wrong, but I don't think this is brushless. Obviously, the Milwaukee is. All right, so guys, just hang in there, all right, with the cobalt stuff. I, I guess that's going to be a Black Friday deal. But again, a pretty aggressive. You're going to see this is two sixty nine, okay? Two hundred and sixty nine dollars. And look, a six amp hour cobalt they want a hundred dollars for. That's insane. I right, just go get a Metabo 21700. And these have 18650s in them, I believe. Um, anyway, so this is 269 alone. Okay? This is going to be part of that combo kit. Okay? For, uh, from what I've seen, 299 I could be wrong. It might be 399 But even at 399 uh, and remember, this is not like the Craftsman and the DeWalt. This is dual bevel. So this is very much like the Rigid. Now, I don't know if it's, you know, that rigid I love. Um, I'm going to have to see. Um, it does have a light also, like the rigid. Um, I like this handle here, but it's very similar to the, to the rigid. Now, obviously, the Milwaukee 2 is dual bevel. They're 7 and a quarter, which we don't hear much about, to be honest with you. Um, but this is going to be $2.99 like in, in a combo kit, from what I've seen. And do you guys know anything about that? And only like 15 of you have sent me the damn picture on Instagram. But you can't say, Soul Boss, yeah, it is. Or maybe you did. I don't know. I'm yelling here for nothing. Well, thank you. I appreciate that, guys. Whoever, who did that? And if I miss you tonight, guys, I apologize. Thank you for everybody. Thank you, Jed Mook. My brother, Jed Mook, man. I appreciate that. I do. Nightbird, Eric, ain't you fool? What's up? Garcia. Tree Boss Mike, what's up? All right, guys, I'm going to... What do we got here? Oh, here's that kit. This has never taken off. This was actually as low as 179 I don't know why they upped the price. Um, You know, not bad, guys. This is 79 bucks. All right? Again, if that TTI, and it's it's very long, too, and big... I mean, I don't think it's 49 bucks. I don't know what happened there. It'll do the job. I'm only doing it with one hand. But you guys know, it's not bad. All right. Um, here's that smaller kit. Um, is this the impact wrench? Oh, you know, here's the brushless. This is 99. Go with the atomic because you get a little bit more torque. This is 199. 
All right. I don't. They ruined a great idea with this, guys. Imagine if they would have put, um, you know, the eight eight seven, maybe or not even that. Maybe if if they just would have put this brushless line in here. Now you do get a brushless tool. This is a really good buy. I'm gonna tell you why though, because this alone is $129 with one battery and a charger. So for another $70, you're getting another battery. You're getting the 885, which it's brushed, but it's a, it's a solid. It's been around for a long time, and a lot of people I know use this daily still. And the 771. If they would have just put the brushless drill driver, it, I bet you to make the brushless drill driver. I bet you to make this impact right here over this impact is probably a $15 difference. And I bet you it's even less than that. If I had a gun in my head, I'd say it's like an $8 difference. If they would have did that and sold this for $229, I think they would have had a lot of success with this. Again, I'm not super impressed with the quality of the bag. It's not bad. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Almost got right here. All right, so... Yeah, here's the only two brushless tools in the Craftsman line. Um, and what do they got here? Um, gloves. Oh, this is a hat. Hat and socks. They have this on Amazon, guys, for like 10 bucks, I think. Oh, here's their 48-piece. I tell you, I like the 40-piece better. You, you don't get any nut drivers with this set. And it's how much? A lot of money. Oh, they got the, they got the music glass. All right, guys. Santa Claus. All right, that's it, guys. Oh, there's the here's the Metabo 199, the one I was showing you. I tell you, this is a nice. It looks like a really nice built miter saw. Again, it's not sliding. It's usually 299. It's obviously a compound here, um, double bevel compound miter saw. It's not. It looks very well built for 199 bucks. But everyone wants a sliding miter saw these days. Um, Here's the cobalt stand. Oh, this is the Delta stand, I mean. All right, Apex owns Delta now. Um, there's the cobalt stand. It's down to 125. I'm telling you, the rigid is much better. But, uh, you know, that's a lot cheaper now, too. Uh, that's really it, guys. I don't know. That's it. Christmas. Here's a $329 planer. All right. All right, let me get out of here, guys. Um, you know what? Let's look at the table saws, and we'll wrap this up. Guys, I appreciate you all coming. I never had... Wow. Yeah, it's, it's the holidays, so people are really... Oh, they make... Lennox makes um, insulated uh, screwdrivers, they, and they probably have done it for a while, but I've never seen them. It, it ain't cheap, but... I think the Milwaukee, you get a... Th is it a two-piece the Milwaukee has, or a three-piece? But they're cheaper than the Milwaukee. Again, I would go with the Weehaws or the Weras, where you get a full set for 29 bucks. Okay, so don't just buy that. All right, the Shopmaster's back down to 